Hey, Ashby Hammond. First of all, how have you been setting into life at Seaford? Yeah, really good. It's a great squad. Uh, lads have been really welcoming since I've come here. Gaffer's great. Management's great. Loving the the setup and and the fans at the games. And I think it's hard to 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 not enjoy. Great start that we've had so far. Everyone's been putting in huge huge shifts every time we've been out. Subs have always done really well. The squad's been well well rotated. Been solid in defence and been put, putting a lot of chances away and just looking strong all over. I think. And you're getting plenty of minutes as well. That must have been one of the key things you wanted when you came. Yeah, in. no, it's given me given me a load of confidence. I think I've settled in, settled in well into my own into my own game. Um, definitely helps having the strength of defence that we do. Um, don't think I've had huge amounts, but when I've been called upon, I think I've done done quite well. So thoroughly enjoying it. Yeah, that back three of TBC, Pitch and Sweeney, that's second to none in this league. It must be an absolute pleasure to play behind. Yeah, absolutely. It's immense. They're all all great on the ball. All great in the air, really strong. Um, couldn't ask for for any more than that. Pitch obviously is a monster in the air, and all one v one defending, really really strong. Couldn't put, couldn't say a bad word about any of them. And now the clean sheets are starting to come through as well. Is that what do you put that down to? Is that down to the defence gelling, or maybe just took some time for for that for that defence to really to really grow? And yeah, yeah, perhaps. Um, I think getting used to to each other, dealing with with the balls into the box and all those other things that, that come with it, balls over the top. But I think down to chance as well. And I think as we go on, as you say, more and more into the season, we'll put more of them together. Let's talk about that penalty save at Crew. What was going through your head when the player was running up to take it? Well, a few of the lads turned to me because they thought I should have come for the first ball. So I was kind of like, oh, shit. I'll believe that. Yeah, OK. <laughs> <laughs> Got to make up for it here. Um, but no, it's um, it one of those ones where it's just gone higher than kind of my body. I'd usually go like if it's right in the bottom corner, stretch out, but it's gone higher than me, and luckily stuck out a, a top hand and, and kept it out. And T was thankful, but I think I was equally as, as thankful as well. So yeah, it was good. And in terms of competition for places, Aaron Chapman's playing the cup games, but you're both really driving each other on because you're both playing really well when called upon. Yeah, absolutely. Chappy is is different is different class. So in training, we're we're both both driving it and I think if the other keepers equally or better than you it, it, it helps it helps either so um, yeah in training we're, we learn off each other and have a good laugh and I think we can only take that into into the games and just a word on Ian Pledger goalkeeper coach what's he like to play under no he's really good great uh, balance in the sessions of, of intense work and then relax when it needs to be so um, yeah keeps me keeps me uh, in good shape and just walking through the training ground, there's there's a real buzz around the place. You must be really enjoying football and the lads are enjoying it, being the top end of the table as well. Just, just adds to that and you want to keep it going for as long as possible. Yeah, definitely. There's nothing like a, um, a team that's winning and a, and a buzz around the place. Is, definitely don't enjoy it when, when it's the other way around. So, yeah, can't beat it. And just finally, how's your week been at Bradbury End? Every, everyone ready to go and rare to go for Crawley on Saturday? Yeah, definitely. Everyone's always sharp. Training's always uh, top top standard. Um, intensity is always great, so feeling fresh, feeling ready to go. Great. Okay. The life of a young goalkeeper these days seems to be loan spells, which is what you've had. I guess from your point of view, you're just happy to be out playing. Absolutely, especially in League Two. Standard I've seen so far is, is great. The team I'm playing with here, everyone is technically a, a really good standard. So I'm coming from academy level to this is only a, a luxury to be here. What's the difference between, I mean, you were at Boreham Wood last year. Um, so what's the difference between the National League and League Two? Is there a noted difference in what you're facing? I think perhaps it's slightly more physical in, in National League. So it's, it's slightly more relaxing perhaps at times, knowing that if a ball comes into the box, you might not get smashed regardless. Um, but I think, yeah, it's, uh, it's a good, good step up for me. And yeah, I think I'm taking a, a chance so far. Have you had much contact with, I mean, do Fulham keep in touch with you on a regular basis to see how things are going? Yeah, I always speak to my keeper coaches down at down at Fulham. They're a great, great sport. Speak to people all over the club. I've been there for quite a long time, so I have good relationships with all of the people there and everyone always is, is looking out for me. So, yeah, it's a great sport having having Fulham there. I think you sang second to Chapman, didn't you? Were you told that you were going to be number one, or was it a case of you know you two are going to slug this out in training and, and you know, decide? No, it's definitely the second option, but um, 
not particularly fussed either way. It's a great opportunity to be even in the door, and it's it's only right that someone should come in and earn the right the right to play. Uh, um, so yeah, that's how it works. Just I just want to finish. I heard uh, Jamie Reed coming in through the door, moaning about his FIFA card. Right. Is um is that something that you've? <laughs> I, I'm just buzzing to be on FIFA. I think it's the, <laughs> I think it's the first time that I've been on it. Um, so yeah, it's great. I'm not definitely not going to moan. I think I saw my speed was pretty criminal, but um, <laughs> yeah, it's probably not wrong either. Stay safe. No problem.